My name is Tony Boothy, and I'm the head football coach at New Prague High School in New Prague, Minnesota. I've been the head coach for 13 years, and I've had the opportunity the last three years to play in the Minnesota Class 4A State Tournament. We're here today on this video to talk about how to build and implement your wing tee offense from the youth program all the way through your varsity. Whether you're a first year coach, fifth year, or a seasoned veteran looking for a new offense, this video today is going to help you with the base formations, base plays, and also has video uh, showing specifically QB, running back, wide receiver, and offensive line basic fundamentals and techniques that are going to help you at your varsity program, but also your youth program and all of your coaches. I hope this video today will help you uh, in installing and developing your own wing tee offense for your program. When installing and developing your wing tee system, it's very important that, number one, <clears throat> you know what your common identity is going to be. The wing tee has been around for a lot of years. The wing tee is more than just a bunch of plays, it's a series. Each series then specifically goes into a wing tee system. As you're building your offense, it's very, very important for you, number one, to know exactly what it is you're doing, not only at the high school level, but also at the junior high and even the youth program. Coaches, what your philosophy may or may not be, but I truly believe here and what many great coaches believe, is that they want their offensive system taught from the youth program all the way through. What this video today is going to show, and it's going to help you with the wing tee system, implement it from your fifth and sixth grade program, your junior high, seventh and eighth grade, your early high school, ninth and tenth, all the way into your varsity program. What we're going to show is number one, why it's important to have a common identity. You as a head coach know exactly what's going on at every level of, of your football program. That's important because if you go down and watch a, a junior high game or even an elementary game and you see your offense from the varsity program being ran, how important is that for your kids as they grow older and as they continue to move up in your program? Three, each year our offense is refined and added to. It's not replaced, it's not brand new, but you're going to refine it, you're going to add to it, the kids are going to know exactly what's going on. Each offensive series uh, and each year, the kids, their previous knowledge is built on. It's not replaced again with this year it's the eye formation, next year it's the veer, next year it's the wishbone, and oh yeah, then we're going to do the wing tee a year after. By them learning each and every year in a progression form, in a progression level, they know exactly what's being taught. The very next year, you as the next year's coach knows what level they're at and what they have been taught, and then you're going to build upon that. Some offensive uh, systems allow for easier movement for coaches. Now, as the head coach coach, you're going to be able to maybe move a ninth grade coach one year to a varsity the next year. We don't have to reteach. We don't have to change the whole offensive system. They know what's being taught in the ninth grade if he's an offensive line coach, and then the next year he's an offensive line coach for your varsity. You know exactly what his knowledge base is.